क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री से इज दैट अ गुलाब जामुन कंटेन्स शुगर सिरप अप टू अबाउट थर्टी परसेंट ऑफ इट्स वॉल्यूम वी हैव टू फाइंड अप्रोक्सीमेटली हाउ मच सिरप वुड बी फाउंड इन फोर्टी फाइव सच गुलाब जामुन ईच शेप लाइक अ सिलेंडर विद टू हेमस्फेरिकल एंड विद लेंथ फाइव सेंटीमीटर्स एंड डायमीटर टू पॉइंट एट सेंटीमीटर्स एंड द फिगर एसोसिएटेड विद दिस क्वेश्चन इज फिगर थर्टीन पॉइंट वन फाइव here we can see a jar which is filled with a certain number of gulab jamuns the question says 45 gulab jamuns and each gulab jamun contains sugar syrup up to about 30% of its total volume so from the very first statement what we can write is the volume of sugar syrup equals 30% of the volume of one gulab jamun and we have to now calculate that how much of syrup would be found in 45 such gulab jamuns so for that we will have to find out the volume of the gulab jamun first so we can draw a gulab jamun like this which is formed with a cylinder and two hemispherical parts attached to its ends so now the total length of the gulab jamun is 5 cm and the diameter is 2.8 cm now the diameter is same for the cylinder and the hemispherical part so we can write it as d equals 2.8 cm therefore the radius for both of them that is the cylinder and the hemisphere will be equal to half of it which will be 1.4 cm now the height of the cylinder is what we have to find now the radius as we have found out for the hemispherical part would be 1.4 and 1.4 each so if we subtract these two 1.4s from the total length which is 5 cm will give us the height of the cylinder which on subtraction is found as 2.2 cm so we can write it as h equals 2.2 cm now to find the volume of a gulab jamun will add the volumes of the two hemispheres and a cylinder so we can then write it as pi r square h which is the volume of the cylinder plus 2 times 2 by 3 pi r cube where 2 represents the two hemispheres and 2 by 3 pi r cube is the volume of the hemispheres now we can take out pi r square so we will be left with h plus 4 by 3 r now let's substitute the values 22 by 7 times 1.4 times 1.4 times h which we have just now calculated as 2.2 plus 4 by 3 times 1.4 and that on further calculation will give us 75.152 divided by 3 cm cube as the volume of one gulab jamun and like that we have 45 gulab jamuns so the volume of 45 gulab jamuns will be equal to 45 times the volume of one gulab jamun so we can then calculate it as 45 times 75.152 divided by 3 and that will give us that the volume of 45 gulab jamuns is 1127.28 cm cube So this is how we find the volume of 45 gulab jamuns. 
Now our next part is to find that in these 45 gulab jamuns, how much of syrup will we find? So as we had already written that the total volume of the sugar syrup is 30% of the volume of 45 gulab jamuns. We can write it as 30 over 100 times 1127.28. And that on further calculation gives us 338.184 centimeter cube, which on approximation gives us the answer as 338 centimeter cube as the volume of the sugar syrup that we find in one jar which is filled with 45 gulab jamuns. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.